Jean Valjean, 1845 one, and that's not it at all. <laughs> I remember the tune. I've got a quick musicals quiz that I'm doing with your co-stars to test your I'm gonna, I'm, knowledge. I'm going to fail. I'm going to fail. I'm telling you, it's going to be okay. It is quite tricky, so I hope you've been doing your prep. I hope you've been revising. I no. I'm terrible. I'm the worst. I will fail, but I will love games, so I will fail. I spent most of my career doing uh, more operatic stuff, so just forgive me in advance. And some of these I probably even have been in, so go. Let's see how I do. I was a really bad test taker in school, so um, don't be shocked if this doesn't go well, but let's give it a go. I have faith in you, okay? The first one is, in A Star Is Born, where does Lady Gaga first sing Shallow? Where does Lady Gaga first sing Shallow? And by the way, that song sh should have ended when the Academy Award. Uh, uh, uh. I, I, I don't know, I can't remember. And my brain is, is getting, if you see smoke, it's fine. That's my brain working. Uh, I don't, I don't remember. She sings Shallow in the parking lot with him after they got the peas for her hand. You got it, I'm impressed. How embarrassing. And by the way, she should have won the Academy Award. I mean, I'm the biggest Lady Gaga fan. There she is there behind me. I am too. I am a monster too. You know why? I'm no, we're, I know we're doing a quiz. Everything comes from here. It's not just about this. Okay, done with, sorry. I'm gonna fail this, go on. I'm telling you, we're kindred spirits. Who plays Meryl Streep's mum in Mamma Mia, the second film? I'll give you a clue. Her name rhymes with hair. <laughs> I love you so much. Thank you so much. Olivia, thank you so much for these hints. Cher, if I could turn back time, I would. Cher. Meryl Streep's mom. Cher. You got it. Thank God, because I did Mamma Mia at the Hollywood Bowl. If I didn't get that one right, it was going to be a disaster. Honestly, it was some of the greatest casting I've ever seen in my life. Like, she did that. She said, Fernando. Ugh. Also, get into her al ABBA album. Like, Cher did that. She really Sorry. did. I mean, truly iconic. You've got to get this one. What's the name of Wilbur's joke shop in Hairspray? Oh, oh no. Oh, no. I don't know. I don't really like that musical. I'm going to have to leave this call. It's one of my favorites. What I meant, what? Oh, no, no. Oh, Hairspray is amazing. It's one of the greatest musicals ever written. I have to tell you, it's the Hardy Ha Hut. Okay, first of all, what time zone am I in? Where am I? How old am I? And I'm pretty sure I was in the TV version of that. So, you know what this tells me, Olivia? I need to retire because I have no idea. Please never, of these please times. never. Thank you, sweetheart. I should have known that. The next one is, what's the longest song in Wicked? Uh, 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 is it, is it, is it, is it, is it, uh, it's the one where they're going to Oz, right? Like they're, um, they're, mm. The longest song. Okay, this is a good question. It's, it's, it's between the two. It's either as long as you're mine or thank goodness. Who's the sage, who's sage and itinerary is making all those merrier. Who's na, 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 na. Neither one, right? One short day in the Emerald City. Is it that one? Popular? According to the internet, it is the internet, but it's dancing through life. You know what I should have guessed? That song never ends. That song never, it never ended for me eight times a week. In fact, it's still going in my head. I think I, I, think I blocked it out. Dancing through life. Of course, it's that 17 minutes, of course. That's the longest song? It's a solo. I'm gonna have to talk to Steven Schwartz about that. I don't know why, why? Here I was thinking it was a big musical number and he's like, no, just one dude dancing around the stage. Don't worry, I won't tell Kristen. Don't worry, don't tell Kristen, I got you back. Because I don't, want, I don't want the wrath of a theater goddess. 
land upon me. We don't want her coming for you. No, no, she will. She will send the town for me and then I'm going to have to levitate sinking gravity and I don't want to do that because I'm going to turn green and green is not a color that suits me. Can you finish the lyrics to raindrops on roses, whiskers on kittens, bright copper kettle and warm woolen mittens, bright copper kettles and warm woolen mittens. Duh. Now you're talking my language, girl. Right, I feel like you're going to get this one. I'll be concerned if you don't get this one. Be concerned. In Schmigadoon, how much does Josh bid for Betsy's basket? Okay, let me think. Three? Twenty dollars. How much money? Twenty. Twenty bucks. Twenty dollars. You're doing well. We're on a roll. It's a medium pizza. It's a medium pizza. I remember the line. You had to get that one. I know. That would be, I'd be really irresponsible of me to not know the answer to that question. <laughs> What's Jean Valjean's prison number in Les Miserables? Ah, oh, I don't know. Oh my God. Okay. Les Mis, Jean Valjean, 1845 one. And that's not it at all. <laughs> I remember the tune. What is it? Two, four, six, oh, one. I tell you, I, I told you from the beginning, I'm going to fail. I, I have I, I have no excuse for this. I have, I don't remember. I saw it so long ago. This is what research is for. If I knew <laughs> that, that my reputation was in the line, I would have studied it. Listen, I would not want to play any game with Debose because she is... First of all, we are very similar. I, she's like one of my little babies now. She's like my little, I'm mentoring her. But first of all, she's no joke. She knows her, I, I know like Julie Andrews, okay? Do you know what? You're the only one that's got that. What? I'm offended. Like I'm taking their musical theater nerd card. It has been revoked and they need to try again. I think I, that's one of the easiest ones as well. Me too. I'm. It's the most icon one of the most iconic numbers ever sung. And then the last one is in Annie, what's the name of her dog? Oh, come on, I did that play. That's really it's a, it's a my god, I don't know. And I and I wanna be honest, I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating. I could cheat, I could grab my iPhone and cheat, but I'm not. I appreciate I the know. honesty. Cindy! Oh thank you. Thank you so much, Sandy. Thank you for giving me one I know. You it's only because yourself. I did the movie 20 years ago. I love you so much. <laughs> it was Sunday. Sun. Oh my God. Oh my God. So bad. Now I need to go back and revisit my revisit my music theater um, degree. <laughs>